Welcome back to 504 Road Trips. Today we continue our journey south on US Highway 61 in Wisconsin, beginning as we leave the city of Fenimore in Grant County. For the beginning of this video, we'll be back to a two-lane highway with shoulders and a 55 mile per hour speed limit, as is pretty standard throughout Wisconsin. Here on the left we see an alternate route of US 61 for trucks, which doubles as State Trunk Highway 129. This route bypasses the city of Lancaster which lies ahead. We enter the city of Lancaster. The town was originally laid out by a land speculator named G.M. Price in 1837. 
The town was named for Lancaster, Pennsylvania by a relative of Price who had migrated from there. The first governor of Wisconsin, Nelson Dewey, lived in Lancaster and was laid to rest there when he died in 1852. Lancaster calls itself the City of the Dome, after the octagonal glass and copper-clad dome of its courthouse, which you can see ahead as we approach the town square. In the spandrels of the courthouse dome are four allegorical murals painted by Franz Edward Rohrbeck. The Lancaster Post Office, a block behind the courthouse, contains a Depression-era mural painted under the Works Progress Administration program in 1940. The stone and wood Patrick and Margaret Kinney House in Lancaster was designed by Frank Lloyd Wright, one of 45 Wright structures in Wisconsin. This town, like many of the towns we drove through, is definitely one to stop and have a look around. At the town square, the roads surrounding the courthouse all become one way and southbound US 61 has to make a trip around the block. Here we pick up concurrencies with State Highways 81 and 35. We were previously on State Highway 35 in La Crosse. We took a lunch break here at Doolittle's Pub, right behind the courthouse. Directly ahead to the right is the City Municipal Building, an example of Prairie School Early Modern Architecture, which, like the courthouse, has been placed on the National Register of Historic Places.
Here, we temporarily become part of the world's smallest parade, consisting of a man on a tractor pulling a wagon with an elderly man in a rocking chair. We conclude today's video as we leave the city limits of Lancaster. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up, post a comment, subscribe, share and follow us on social media, and join us for our next 504 road trip.